Now, let's head to Kampung Chai Rancha Upas camping site located in Chiwide, south of Bandung. Close to the camping site, there's a beautiful crater lake that somehow reminds us of Snow White with some local mystical nuance. In 1837, a German botanist who carried out research in Indonesia heard about some local stories about a certain area in the south. There was a place where birds were reluctant to fly nearby and the forest was eerie and mysterious. The locals feared it, so he went there to investigate. He found Kawah Puti and documented it for the first time for the Western world. The water itself changes colors from bluish to whitish, green, or brown depending on the concentration of sulfur, the temperature, or the oxidation state. The sulfur smell is quite strong around here because there's a lot of steam and sulfurous gas bubbling from the lake. So guys, to get here, the ticket price is 18,000 per person and you have the option of either taking your own car up here which costs 150,000 for one vehicle or you can take these, what we call with Amphods and that is 33,000 per person. Kawah Puti is open for tourists since 1987 by the local forestry units. The surrounding area is still heavily forested. There are tracks around the lake where you can walk and sit on shelters. You can also follow one of them through the forest to reach the top of Mount Patuha. Guys, I think this place is really well thought because if you have your parents with you or disabled people, I think you can just take this alley over here and then they could see the view from above. This afternoon, I am at Kawah Puti, or translated as the White Crater. Unlike the Tangguban Prahu, where you can only see it from top, here you can actually stand this close to the solver. But still the same rules, 15 to 30 minutes max, and that's it for safety reasons. Stay with us on I Indonesia, where you will see Indonesia from the eyes of the locals. In the northern part of Bandung so what I read when I came in it is a conservation area it's still very cool and breezy and if I look around it's still very natural but I don't know what they have here so let's look around So guys, as I walked around, I saw a deer breeding site. So here we can interact with them and you can give them carrots by paying 5,000 rupees for one whole bag. I can't wait, let's feed them.
So guys, it is recommended to stay on these planks for safety reasons because you never know what will happen. But it's a very fun activity and after this I'm gonna explore more what's around in this area. that beautiful view behind me so from the deer area I walked towards the back and then I found this so this is the camping ground and by the way it has beautiful sunrise they by the way they provide you the tents and woods for campfire and there are toilets available so pick what you need 